Hi there. Now in this question, we're told that in an arithmetic progression, the ninth term is 18 and the sum of the first nine terms is 72. And what we've got to do is find the first term and the common difference. So if you'd like to have a go at this and haven't done so already, I'll just give you a moment to pause the video. Okay, welcome back then if you had a go. If you'd like to check your answers, you can just fast forward or I'll take you now through the solution. So we're given, first of all, okay, that the ninth term is 18. So I can write this as u9 and it equals 18. Now, we should be familiar with the fact that when you've got an arithmetic progression, first term is a, common difference is d, then the second term will it be a plus d, third term would be a plus 2d, and so on. So the nth term will be un equals a plus n minus 1d. And we can pick up on this fact that if the ninth term is 18, then we've got a plus 9 minus 1, so it's going to be 8, d must equal 18. So let's just write that in here, that therefore we've got a plus 8d must equal 18. Now, the other fact that we're given, we'll just put here also, the other fact that we're given is that the sum of the first nine terms is 72. So this is the formula that we're going to use for the sum of the first n terms and of, of an arithmetic progression. Again, you should be familiar with this formula. It's equal to n over 2, all multiplied by 2a plus n minus 1d. So we know that s9 is equal to 72. So therefore, what we've got by the formula is n is 9. So we've got 9 over 2, all multiplied by twice the first term. So that's going to be 2a plus n minus 1, so it's 9 minus 1, which is 8, times d. So you've got 2a plus 8d. And this equals 72. So if I just say multiply both sides by 2 and divide by 9, that's going to give me 2a plus 8d is equal to 72, multiplied by 2, and that's all divided by 9. And I can see that I can cancel this. 9s go into 72 8 times. So I'm just left with 8 twos are 16. So just recap, we've got therefore 2a plus 8d equals 16. Now I've got two equations with two unknowns, a and d. So in order to solve these, we're just going to use simultaneous equations. So I'll number them then 1 and 2. And if I do equation 2 minus equation 1, then I can see that this gives us, well, 2a minus a, that just gives us a. 8d minus 8d, that cancels to 0. And you've got equals 16 minus 18, which is minus 2. So we've got the first term, a which is minus 2. We've got to go on and find that common difference. So if we just border this off down here, then all I've got to do is substitute a equals minus 2 either into equation 1 or 2 to find d. I'm going to sub that value of a equals minus 2 then into, say, equation 1. And if I do that, We've got minus 2 then, therefore minus 2 plus 8d equals 18. And if I add 2 to both sides, I've got ad equals 20. Divide both sides by 8, and you've got d equals 20 divided by 8. And 4 goes into top and bottom here, so therefore d will be equal to 5 over 2, or 
two and a half, two point five. I'll just leave it though as d equals five over two. Okay.